Let's talk about using or supplementing with magnesium to help muscle cramps. Does it work? Um, I'll get into that, but let's start at the basics here. First of all, yes, we know that magnesium is involved in allowing your muscles to relax. So in theory, it would make sense that supplementing could help cramps. But here's something to think about. Like a lot of things in your body, it's not just about magnesium. It's not that simple. Okay. So we know, for example, if you have low thyroid, many people with hypothyroid experience issues with muscle contractions, we can see cramps, stiffness, slowness of muscle relaxation and exercise intolerance. And we can see this in roughly 30 to 80% of patients with low thyroid. Here's another thing to think about. A lot of cramping you see it in athletic events. So athlete will pull up with a uh, muscle cramp and what is going on is usually they're hyperventilating they're exerting themselves hyperventilating they get extreme muscle contraction but we see a similar effect in thyroid folks um, because when your thyroid is low one of your body's natural re reactions is to bump up stress hormones those stress hormones pr predispose low thyroid folks to hyperventilation and we see these muscle issues what resolves that? What resolves that is carbon dioxide. When people produce more carbon dioxide and produce more ATP energy, that can help alleviate this hyperventilation and this cramps and stiffness. And what that comes down to is that if you're producing more CO2, you're producing more ATP, that means that you have a healthy metabolism. What I wanna bring this back to is Generally speaking, we see more of these muscle cramping issues in people with poor metabolism, okay? Can magnesium help with cramping? It's possible, but it's not just about magnesium. It's about your metabolism, okay? So that's what I want you to think about. Furthermore, they have done studies on just giving people magnesium to help cramping. They're not that promising. They've seen some benefit in women who are pregnant, but in regular population, we don't tend to see a ton of benefit. And they're at fairly high doses, like 500 milligrams plus of elemental magnesium, which is a big dose. Does that mean you couldn't try it? Magnesium's pretty safe. <clears throat> Your biggest risk is seeing loose stools if you dose too high, particularly with magnesium citrate. So if you want to try it, I wouldn't be against it. Um, obviously talk to your doctor, but I would probably try like a magnesium glycinate or uh, naturally calm. And I'll put a link to those. I just wouldn't expect them to be a cure-all um, because if you see cramping, always think poor metabolism. How do you fix that metabolism? You have to eat the right foods. I've made a video about that. Go check it out particularly if you're low thyroid. I think you're gonna get more benefit from that than you would just supplementing magnesium. But if you have supplemented magnesium, let me know in the comments, was it helpful, was it not helpful? Um, your comments are helpful for me. They're also really beneficial to other people watching the video. Speaking of which, I hope this video was beneficial and I'll see you in the next one, guys. Thank you.